If you are visiting our channel for the first time, please subscribe first to get the basic and advanced math concepts. In our previous lecture, we have seen the method number one of finding the equation of tangent to circle by using the standard equation of tangent to the circle that we have already derived. Uh, now we, uh, we will learn the method number two that you can use to find the equation of tangent. This is also an easy method uh, that you can use to find the equation of tangent to the circle. So in this method, the step number one is you have as you have to use the point slope formula. So if for point slope formula, uh, what you need and what is given is we have to write it here. So for point slope formula, we need a point of tangent and the slope of tangent. So we need these two things to find the equation of tangent to the given circle. So according to the given data, what we have is the point of tangent that is 4 and 3 and we don't have the slope of the tangent. So we have to find the slope of the tangent. How we can find that? Let's see. Step number two is find slope of tangent. And how you can find the slope of tangent? Slope of tangent is actually that is the derivative of the give, uh, of the equation of the given curve at the point at the point where we want to find the equation of tangent. So we have to take the derivative of this uh, equation for finding the slope of tangent at four and three. So the equation is x square plus y square equals to 25 we have to derivate it with respect to x so I'll get 2x plus 2y dy by dx equals to 0 as the derivative of constant is 0 so if I rearrange it and keep dy by dx on one side what I have to do is dy by dx will be equals to what minus x over y so we have uh, uh, finally simplify it so dy by dx is minus x y uh, x over y this is basically the slope of the circle of the given circle but if you want to find the slope of the tangent you have to put the values of x and y so it means dy by dx at with the value values x and y is 4 and 3 so i have to put the value of x and y as minus 4 over 3 this is the slope of tangent that that is required slope of tangent at 4 and 3 so we have got the two things that we actually need now we move towards the step number 3 what we have to do is we have to put the values of this of the point and slope into the point slope formula so I'll write using point slope form as what is the point slope formula let's write it y minus y1 equals to m into x minus x1 where y1 and x1 are the points at which we have to find the equation of tangent and m is the slope so let's put the values here and let's see what we get so y minus what is y1 y1 is this 3 this is y1 and this is x1 so y minus 3 equals to what is the slope it's minus 4 by 3 and what is x1 it's 4 so let's simplify it as 3 into y minus 3 equals to minus 4 into x minus 4 so 3y minus 9 equals to minus 4x plus 16 and if we rearrange it we will get 4x plus 3y equals to 25 so we have got the value of, we have got the equation of tangent to the circle so this is what this is basically the equation of tangent so this is how you can find the equation of tangent by using the point slope, slope form Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe our channel math.com for more updates. Thank you.